So to access time code and user bit, what you want to do is you want to tap menu, which is in the upper left hand corner. And then you'll go up to the setup, uh, which is a red toolbox. And then the third icon down on the left here is time code, so if I select that, this is the time code menu here. So you've got time code, user bit display, um, counter, of course, time code, user bit, counter. That's the only thing. And then you have time code preset. So, oops. Time code preset, so you can come in here and you can adjust right. you know, any of these digits here. Okay. Okay. So this and then, of course, user bit preset, same type of thing. So I can go in and I can uh, okay. touch controls, okay. change the scene mode, whatever. Okay. Uh, so the, the format down here. Can you record now? Uh, I don't believe we have a memory card in here, but uh, we we'll back out of this. Okay, if so so, you stop and start so the, the, with the time code, makes, how does so, it continue? So yeah, so there's a two different modes. So um, we saw that in the first menu option under time code user bit. So there's a uh, counter where basically when you stop recording, it's going to stop the, the, the um, time. Uh, and then as soon as you start recording again, it's, the clock starts again. Um, there's also a run mode where it's constantly running. Whether you start and stop or not, the clock is still running, and then it's going to um, just, you know, whatever you want to start to record again, it'll pick up from that moment. But what's the capability? Yeah, yeah so you, you can, through multicam control, you can actually, um, let me take you there, back up out of the menu here, go into the wireless setting. Um, I can actually connect this camera via uh, my smartphone, um, and also other cameras, either similar cameras, camcorders like this, or a POV cam. Or an interchangeable lens, uh, you know, kind of like a mirrorless or DSLR. Action cam. Action cam. Yep. Um, so here you can see it's it's picking up some of the other action cams here as well. Okay. But um, it, and it'll generate time code to them, and so when when you press record, it'll use this time code. So from what I understand, um, you can set up your time code from in each individual camera. Right. Uh, I'm not sure that there's a way to sync the time code across. That's the point um, of the ones. Yeah. I mean, there should be a way to do.